Hey, y'all, it's Claude. You're checking me out again at Mostly Healthy Food Reviews. <laughs> so what's going on, everybody? First of all, I want to say this Happy Memorial Day and Happy Memorial Day weekend. And hopefully you guys had a good weekend. It's Monday. It's Memorial Day. And I'm out here. You see the shirt, man. Celebrating our independence. And we're celebrating all the Armed Forces members, both past and present. Some of the people in my family, my Uncle Marion, my Uncle uh, Van, rest in peace. My sister Shauna, who's retired military. To my daughter Ashley, who's currently in the military, her and my niece Naja. And Ashley, very proud of you. She just became a sergeant, U.S. military, 23 years of age. I salute everybody involved. I do want to say this. One of the pastimes of Memorial Day weekend and things like 4th of July is usually food, cookouts, right? So you're around friends and family and loved ones and, and you're having fun. But just keep in mind while we actually celebrate these holidays, guys. All I want to say now, though, is that I don't eat hot dogs, traditional hot dogs and burgers anymore. I did when I was younger. However, now I'm into fish. So with that being said, I wanted to stop by a place and showcase to you guys a place that I haven't been to in a while. A place that I have been to and haven't been to in a while. I'm talking about Captain's Cove. Now, I can't represent Bridgeport correctly, Bridgeport, Connecticut, my city, and all the videos that I do to showcase different mom and pa establishments without touching down on this landmark. They've been around since the 80s. They used to have some delicious, delicious food, especially their fried cod. Fish, fish, fish. And that's what I want to do today because to me, it's American to literally step up and have some really, really good, thick, thick, breaded nicely codfish. Hopefully, Captain's Cove still has it for me. But in either case, I want to show you all around a little bit, show you what's going on. And as usual, let's get into the food, baby. Mostly healthy food reviews. Let's get started. One thing the Cove is known for is basically their nightlife. They have a lot of bands here, different genres as far as music goes, and they have a really nice bar upstairs. Plus you can go out on a deck, you can actually have a drink if you want, adult beverages of course, or you can actually have some of their delicious food. Let's go upstairs real quick, I'll show you what I'm talking about. So 
that is the bar area, an outside deck upstairs. Great, great establishment, great place. And uh, not much has changed. It actually kept a lot of the, the flavor, the vibe here the same. And honestly, that's what's the charming thing about this place. Let's head downstairs real quick and uh, let's go get the food, man. That's why we're here, right? There you have it. This is Captain's Cove, Marina and Seaport, Bridgeport, Connecticut. As usual, I'm going to drop the address in the bottom of the video. Now, let's get right to it. Let's get right to it. You saw the walk up. You saw the ambiance. You saw the bar. You saw the shops. You saw the food. Oh! As far back as I can remember, and I'm going to take this back to the 80s probably, I'm going to say that this has always been one of the best fish and chips places around. It's not up for debate for me. It's not up for dispute. If you're in Connecticut, if you're in Bridgeport, and you guys know Captain's Cove, you know what the fish and chips tastes like. Right now, they're doing them on Wednesday. You get a nice, chunky piece of cod. Boneless, obviously, full of flavor, soft and succulent and it's crispy on the outside with the seasoning that's battered and it's nicely battered. You get the fries and stuff and that's cool, but that fish, you couldn't get fresher fish unless you were hanging out with SpongeBob or something like that. This is honestly, it hasn't changed in all these years. It actually is still really, really good food. That's the whole point. And if you know, like I know, and you're in the area, this is where you need to come on, over to Boswick Avenue. Oh my goodness, this is good stuff. I gotta give it a score. I don't even wanna score it, cause I'm gonna be biased if I do, but I gotta score it, right? Captain's Cove, Marina and Seaport, Fish and Chips, Wednesday, $6.99, or $7 or whatever you like for some fish and chips, you get a one piece. <sighs> Here we go. I'm going with a 10. I'm going with a straight 10. I love this fish. I love it, love it, love it. And I'm having a cookout in my car right now. So instead of the burgers and dogs for Memorial Day weekend, I'm actually having fish in the car. And this is what New England 
in Bridgeport should be tasting like right here. This is it. I'm done. Let me finish my fish. Uh, uh, hold on, I didn't finish the video yet. <laughs> I'm excited and eager to finish eating my fish right now. In either case, ladies and gentlemen, if you like the videos, do me a favor, click subscribe, turn notifications on. That way you get my level of madness. Mondays, Fridays, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard, and during the week as time permits, I'm switching things up a little bit. If I drop a video on Wednesday or Thursday, it might be as early as 11 a.m. I don't know. It depends on how I feel about it. But once again, this is Claude at Mostly Healthy Food Reviews. YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, Newsbreak. I'm on all social media platforms. If there's a health bonus to my food, it's an added bonus. Captain's Cove, love your fish and chips. I've loved them for years. You have not changed. <sighs> Please do me a favor. Don't ever change anything about that recipe. Ever. Please don't. In either case... Let me get up out of here. Y'all be cool on the other side of the pillow. I'll talk to you next time. Happy Memorial Day.